Hello dear friends today we will learn topic terminating and non terminating numbers these are two types of decimal numbers we know what decimal number is decimal means we have to give a point and after point the number comes that is known as decimal numbers the decimal numbers are read as 1 2 3 4 they if they cannot be read as we read the normal numbers there are two types terminating and non terminating the word terminating means end we often hear the word terminating near railway stations as the train the train will terminate or the train has terminated it means the train has ended and it will move aside okay so done with that terminating means end so terminating numbers are the numbers or are the decimal numbers that end like when we are successfully completing the division of any numbers as 1 upon 4 2 upon 5 or etc etc we say that these numbers were terminated because we were we successfully completed or successfully divided the numbers by decimal point next is non terminating numbers a uh, non terminating has two types recurring non terminating and non repeating non terminating recurring is also known as repeating numbers so recurring numbers means after decimal point that numbers continuously repeats that number is infinitely repeated as many as times non repeating numbers means we cannot repeat that number various numbers come after decimal points so let's start with the terminating one first example 1 upon 4 So four ones are uh, so four one is there four zero is a zero one ten four two is a eight two carry oh means two is the remainder zero comes and two five is a twenty. Thus we are successfully done with the division of one upon four and we got zero point two five, which is nothing but equals to one upon four. One upon four is in fraction form and zero point two five is in decimal form, and this is totally done. therefore it is a terminating number so here let us move to the next question of terminating numbers only next is 2 by 5 2 by 5 is in fraction form and we will convert this fraction form into decimal so sorry 5 upon 2 like this 5 is the divisor divisor and 2 is the dividend 5 zeros are Zero, two, then point five four is a twenty. Done with the division successfully. So this is also the example of terminating number. That is zero point four. We cannot. We are not supposed to extend that numbers by adding any numbers. We are successfully done with that. That is nothing but terminating numbers only. Hope you are done with the terminating numbers. Let us move to the next. idea or the next topic that is non terminating numbers as i told you it is having two types repeating and non repeating so when we will divide 1 upon 3 we will get one repeated number after the decimal point let's divide 3 uh, divide 3 is divisor 3 zeros are 0 1 carry point 3 3 are 9 1 uh, then again then again what will happen again 0 3 3 is a 9 again One zero three three is a nine. Continuously, this will only happen, right? Infinitely, if you continue this, you like whole day. If you try to solve this problem, you won't be able to solve it. And it's because infinite. And as we know, after decimal point, the three is the number which is continuously coming, right? So this is the repeating, non-terminating numbers because it continuously comes after one another, one another, one another. But uh, we cannot write this number as it is in exam, right? So there is one technique to write that number. That is, we have to give a bar. That is a small underscore type something. Just uh, underscore is like below. This is overscore. We just have to give one dash above that number which is continuously coming or which is repeated. Okay, this is known as bar. So zero point three, three is repeated. Here continuously three is only repeated. That's why it is repeating. Now non-repeating. Uh, we know twenty to one seven. It's a pi value of pi, and we often write value of pi. Often is we write the value of five, 
pi as one three point one four only. But no, one four is not the last digit. We can write several numbers. Okay, let's focus on the division now. Seven, uh, twenty two, seven three is a twenty one. One carry zero point seven one the seven three zero comes seven four zero twenty eight and then zero sorry twenty 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 is remainder two zero carry two seven to the fourteen sixteen now seven is the fifty six uh okay because seven seven the forty nine so seven is the fifty six seven is the sixty three so seven eight is the fifty six will is the uh is the what We will write seven at the fifty six, and then what we will write? Four will come, then seven five the thirty five. If you continuously do that, then you will just get several numbers of different different types. You will not reach the end of this thing. Okay, you will not reach the end if you continuously move on. Therefore, we will st uh, stop here only. And finally, the answer we got is three point one four two eight five and etc etc. So this number is different. After decimal point, there are different numbers. Okay, there are different types of numbers after decimal point. Those they are non-repeating numbers, non-repeating, non-terminating numbers. Okay, thank you.